Good morning. Oh, hi. Hi, good me. morning. Sorry to bother you guys, but I'm kind of lost. Oh, no uh, problem. We yeah. can help you. Yeah, yeah. You. I'm, I'm trying to get from Central Plaza to the clock tower. And I think I've been all around Chiang Rai. I cannot find it. It's easy. Very easy, right? Yeah, simple. So go out of Central Plaza okay. and you turn left. Okay, and walk for a very, very long way, okay? Mm -hmm. Past two sets of traffic lights, yeah? Mm, and no, 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 no. I think when you leave Central Plaza, you take the first right. Right, okay. oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Right. yeah. Turn right. Yeah, keep going. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think you'll pass a 7-Eleven. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, right. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, turn, yeah. Do you turn at the 7-Eleven, right? Yes, yes. You have to turn at the 7-Eleven. I turn at the, or I go through the 7-Eleven. No, you turn. You turn left or right? Right. Turn right. Left. left. Oh, yeah, yeah, right. Fantastic. Left, that's yeah, right. Yeah, right or yeah, left. Yeah, right. Left, left is right. Okay, and, uh, oh yeah, then you just walk. And then you're there? Yeah. It's right there, and right in front of you. Sounds so easy, thank uh, yeah, you. Very, very, yeah, very, very easy. Okay. Good Thanks. luck. Thanks a lot. All right. See you. Bye-bye. guys. Are you all lost like me? Hi students, it's teacher George. So like you saw in the role play, we can get really confused when we get directions from someone. So it is very important that we give correct directions or else you can really get lost okay so let's dig into some directions basic ones so you can whenever someone asks you for directions you know what to say okay so let's start <clears throat> very easy ones go right so or take your right go left or take your left go straight okay uh, turn back or reverse uh, take the first exit to the right or to the left okay so if you're going straight and then you say take your first exit to the left or to the right now uh, also like if there's a second you know like you don't want to take the first one you want to take the second one so take the second exit to the left or to the right now you know the u-turn you make a u-turn okay uh, get to an intersection, you know, an intersection. Yeah, I'll show you now in a bit what is an intersection if you don't know. And then roundabout. Okay, so what is an intersection? So an intersection is when two roads or streets intersect. Okay, so that is an intersection. Okay, now about roundabout, it's as well two roads or streets intersecting, but there is a roundabout in the middle. Okay, so if we go further, so at the roundabout, you can say, so take your first left or take the first exit, which is, so if you're coming from here, so this is your first exit, okay? Now, if you continue, so this is your second, you continue further, you might have an accident, no. <laughs> so this is the third exit, okay? So now let's do an activity, okay? So students, you were paying attention yes. to the directions, yeah? Of course. Ah, uh, very good. So because I'm gonna test you. Mm. Mm. So we're gonna have an activity. It's a fun activity, okay? Let's see. <sighs> very good. So, Shine, you are here. Mm -hmm. Okay, can you give me the correct directions to go from here to the bus station. Okay. Okay, now you're walking, of course, okay? Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to walk through the first intersection. Yes, which is this one, very good. Yeah. Uh, then when I get to the roundabout, mm -hmm. I take the third exit. Fantastic, so you skip the first mm -hmm. and the second and you take the third mm. exit, fantastic. Then. I uh, keep walking and the bus station will be on my left. Fantastic. Yes. Very good, Sean. Excellent. Yes. You were paying attention. Nice. That's good. 
<laughs> okay. Uh, Dylan. So. Okay. Dylan, I want you to go the same, like from, from here to the bus station, but choose another road. Another, another road. Yeah. Okay? Okay. So, if I'm here. Yes. I keep going mm -hmm. till I get to the first intersection. Yes. I take the first right. Yeah. Okay. Onto Green Street. Yeah. I keep going until I take the first left. Very good. And I keep going until I reach the King's Road and I go right. Mm -hmm. And then I reach the bus station. Fantastic. Great job, guys. Okay. So now it is your turn. Okay. So give it a try. So students, I want you to give me the correct directions. You want to go from the factory to the hospital. Okay. Now you have five minutes to do that. Good, Good job, job students. students! Students, now if you know the name of the roads, streets or avenues, you can use that to give better directions. Okay, so let's try now with this example to use that, okay? So, Sean, mm -hmm. please, I want you, so let's say you're at the camping site with your friends. Okay. okay. Your mom just called you. And she said, Sean, please, I want you to go to the butcher's shop to buy some bacon. And then you meet me at the cinema in 30 minutes. Okay, so <clears throat> hmm. how are you going to go? Tell me the directions. Give me the correct directions to go from the camping site hmm. to the butcher shop and then to the cinema. Hmm. Okay. okay, think about it. Yeah. So I'm going to come out of the camping site. Yeah. And Remember, you can use the road names mm -hmm. yeah, and street names. So I come out of the camping site mm -hmm. I turn left yes. on the King's Way. Fantastic. Over the bridge. Yeah. Until I get to Queen's Avenue. Very good. Where I turn right. Mm -hmm. And at the intersection, the first That's intersection, good. I'm going to turn left down Oxford Street. Very good. And then take the first right down Baker Street and get to the butchers. Fantastic. Okay, now you want to go to the cinema. To the cinema, yeah. okay. okay. Okay, so I come out of the butchers and I turn right on Prince's Road until I get to the roundabout. Mm -hmm. And I take the third exit. Fantastic. Back onto Queen's Avenue. Very good. And at the next intersection, mm -hmm. the cinema will be on the left on Oxford Street. Very good. Excellent. Great job. Students, it's your turn. Okay? So, please, I want you to go from the petrol station to the shopping center. And then from the shopping center, I want you to go to the restaurant. Okay? Now you have five minutes to do that. Okay? Good job, students! So, students, let's make it a bit harder, okay? Ta-da! Okay, <laughs> I know it's a little bit, a little bit hard. No? Hmm. Okay, so student Sean, student Dylan, mm -hmm. you can work together on this if you find it difficult. Mm -hmm. Okay, so please, I want you to give me the correct directions to go from, choose if you want, from, okay. The provincial office. Provincial office, let's say, to the clock tower. Clock tower. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Work together. Mm. Okay. So I think we come out from the provincial office mm -hmm. and turn right yes. at the intersection. Yes. And we come down. Can you also name the roads? <laughs> yeah. We can come down Trirat Road. Mm hmm. Okay, we go past one intersection, yes. two intersections, three, three. intersections. Yes. So at the fourth intersection, Very good. 
we turn left onto Ban Pa Prakan Road. Mm -hmm. And then we, at the next intersection, we get to the clock tower. Fantastic. Oh, it's quite easy. Ah, mm. very good. Okay, so now students, it's your turn. And I would like you to give me the directions um, to going to from the bus station to Overbrook Hospital. Mm. Mm. Okay, you have 10 minutes. Great work, Great work. students. So students, I hope you enjoyed the lesson and have learned many things that would help you give directions to anyone, especially when you meet foreigners, okay? So guys, what do we do now? Mm, let's go to the clock tower. Yeah? Fantastic. I know a restaurant there. Let's go have lunch. Okay. Okay. All right. Bye. videos. We're gonna keep on trying harder and harder to make them better and better. Thank you!